Welcome cuties, let's create. Good afternoon everybody. I'm excited for this one because this is my last um, holiday outfit series for this year. I am gonna get continue it into next year. Um, I want to try to see if I can come up with some different ones um, and kind of make them um, more, oh, what's the word, holiday themed. So we shall see. The first thing that I do is I always like to kind of sketch out some different um, aspects of or little things that remind me of the holiday. So this holiday in particular is a Christmas tree. I have a present. I have a Christmas light and a Santa hat. Here I am just going to be sketching out just some uh, different ideas for an outfit um, just because there are so many different ways that I could go with this. Um, first of all, I could make it look like Santa. <laughs> So I could give her the big belt, I could give just a red dress, and have, um, you know, the puffy bottom and puffy sleeves. And I didn't really like that because that seems too easy and just kind of like not challenging enough, I guess is the word. So this next one I decided to, um, well, we'll see. I honestly can't remember. I also want to try doing different necklines. So this one I tried more of a square neckline. I kind of took inf in inspiration from the present and decided what if she had a ribbon around her waist instead of a belt. And something that I actually really like with Christmas is there's... Um, Oh, here I'm doing candy cane themed. Um, but for the next outfit, I kind of get inspiration of doing a plaid themed. Um, I don't really draw a whole lot of plaid because I don't feel like I'm good at plaid. But this is kind of the first one that I, spoiler, I do end up doing plaid. Um, just because I want a bit of a challenge and a bit of something different. And I figured that I would, I was like, maybe I'll do the puffiness at the bottom. I decided to do a different piece of clothing that I normally have never drawn a whole lot. I decided to give a turtleneck and I was like, maybe I will give at first, I was going to draw short sleeves, but then decided to do like three-quarter length sleeves. I think that would look cute and look um, more realistic with a turtleneck. Um, I don't think, I mean, I, I'm sure there are some uh, short sleeve turtlenecks out there, but I figured uh, three-quarter made more sense than the short sleeve. I didn't want to do long sleeve. Um, that's just a personal preference. And... At first I was like, oh, let's do this bow because that's cute. And um, then I was trying to decide if I should do the puffiness at the bottom of the sleeves. I don't think I end up doing that. Let me hurry and get... <laughs> I honestly can't remember. I like look through... I filmed this a, you know, a little while ago. And I kind of forget what they look like by the time I get to filming my voice. Okay, I do end up doing puffy sleeve. <laughs> Little do I know. Um, but um, just because I wanted to do, you know, add a little bit of something um, throughout. And what I end up doing actually is I decide to get rid of the bow um, from her waist and give her a bow in her hair instead and I do a belt. So that's kind of the inspiration that I got and I have a little bit of candy cane. Not really but her bottom half I just have a white uh, white stripes at the bottom. Um, so it's not really candy cane but um but yeah, so I was actually really excited. Um, this one I really like. I think it turned out so good. And oh my gosh, I I just really enjoy doing this, you know, holiday um, outfit series because I think it's really fun. I 
I I just think it's so cute. And this one turns out good because I also tried to do a different, um, oh my gosh, I always forget what I'm, what the words are. <laughs> what words? What are words? Um, but I tried a different pose as well and I actually did not do it from reference. So I actually give props to myself because I, as you can see right here, I'm actually sketching out the um, pose. So, and I did have to fidget because the way that her hand is, it's almost like she's double jointed. <laughs> so yeah and then as I continued and I was like oh my gosh her hand is like way too low so I ended up moving that a little bit and um, when I get into the fine lining and the outlining of this out uh, this uh, drawing I end up kind of um, fixing up her arm just a little bit so this was actually really hard to do because this is a brush tip um, for this marker and I was really scared because I, with plaid there's thin lines and then there's thick lines and I was scared for the thin lines because if you press too hard then your thin lines no longer look thin they look thick <laughs> So it was a bit of a challenge, but it ends up okay. It turns out okay. I think it's cute. Oh my gosh. I'm like looking, now I'm looking at the finished picture and uh, I'm just so, so proud. Um, I actually, I know this is totally random, but I also love how the foot turns out. So yay. Um, but anyway, I, yeah coloring it was fun. I just really enjoyed this drawing a lot and I think it's so fun. Christmas is one of my favorite holidays. Um, comment down below what your favorite holiday is. I'm always curious if, you know, because everyone has different, um, different likes and stuff like that. I used to like um, Thanksgiving not too long ago because it just seems like a warm and cozy, um, you know, you just sit around eat food, take naps. <laughs> it just seemed, you know, um, but Christmas is just, it's, there's a magicalness in my opinion to me, um, with this holiday. So I really like Christmas and please also comment down below, not only what your favorite holiday is, but also comment what your traditions are. So, um, things are a bit different now that I'm married. Um, but we always like to visit family and we bounce back and forth um, between family and it's my my family we always wake up insanely early <laughs> on christmas day and um we get to play with the presents in our stocking and then once my dad finally wakes up, we get to open presents and my mom makes a breakfast casserole every year and then we just kind of hang out the rest of the day and then just enjoy presents and just kind of sit around. We take naps because we woke up so dang early. Um, but this last year we also, you know, because um, it was our first married Christmas and so then we also went to um, his grandparents house and it's just fun you know it's it's a time to be with family and to enjoy and I do have to admit I love having a white Christmas and so we go up to Utah and, and and we get to see my family as well and I like having the white Christmas because down here in uh, Texas you don't really get a white Christmas <laughs> and I have to admit I like having a white Christmas so what I was doing with this hair, back to the drawing, I'm gonna bounce back and forth here for a second. Um, I decided, I was like, I want kind of like an auburn color, like a brownish red. And at first I had, you know, I laid down this very light red and then I went over with a light brown and I end up going it over with a dark brown and it turns out the perfect color. Cause I do have a, 
for my Artify markers, I do have a wine red, but I wanted it more brown looking and I feel like this actually turned out perfect of um, what I was going for. But yeah, so back to traditions. Um, something that I have decided, and I don't know if I said this in my Thanksgiving um Oh my gosh, Thanksgiving video, <laughs> but um, I've decided that for a tradition that I want to start is doing Christmas pajamas at Thanksgiving because then you get to actually wear them all through December where I know a lot of people um, and in the past when I was growing up, uh, my grandparents would give us Christmas pajamas on Christmas Eve and they weren't necessarily Christmas themed or anything. Um, but you know, you only get to wear them. Well, I mean, whatever, but, um, this year I actually bought Christmas themed pajamas. Um, and so I get to wear them all through the December instead of just on Christmas Eve and Christmas. And it just makes sense to me. So that's something that I want to start with my tiny little family. So with me and my husband, even though he, men just don't really wear pajamas so he got new sweatpants there we go <laughs> that's what he got because he sometimes he'll just you know wear sweatpants or whatever and I just go pajamas are different there's a difference in my opinion that's just me but yeah I I really hope all of you have a Merry Christmas and I hope you get to all enjoy and I hope you get all the things that you are wanting for Christmas and more and yeah I I hope you enjoy and have a good happy holiday
Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, ring the bell, give the video a like or a comment, stay a while and watch a couple more episodes, and until next time, keep creating!